Hi everyone, today we're going to take a look at this hand crank generator from CDR King, often referred to as a Dynamo, which is actually a brand name. Now the basic idea of this is that you've got a USB port and when you crank it, it generates electricity. And according to the specifications on the back, it's outputting 6 volts and 500 milliamp or up to, depending on how fast you crank it. Now I have a feeling these are old stock that are being put into new packaging because when I was buying this, the first one that the staff opened was full of scratches. The second one they opened didn't work and then finally the third one was okay. And and some of the information on the back just doesn't match up with what we've got here. For example, it says 30 seconds of cranking equals 5 minutes of bright light. But there's no LED on here. The only LED is the charge LED, the red one when you turn it. And as soon as you stop cranking, it pretty much turns off. There's a very, very dim light in there. But I don't think that's what they're talking about because firstly it's red and secondly no matter how long you spin this for or crank it for you don't get any you don't get anywhere near like one minute two minute three minute you don't get any light now aside from the hand crank you also get a little usb extension cable and this little lanyard thing so here i have a little usb led bulb that i got from cdr king let's plug that in and you can see that it does light up although it's not as bright as if I plugged it into a power bank or a wall AC USB socket. Here's a 5 watt LED strip from CDR King. Let's try plug this one in and crank the dynamo. Now one thing you might be able to hear is the gears skipping or grinding against each other because when you try to power something which is drawing too much current, the gears start to skip and scrape against each other because they're just plastic. Listen to this. So you can hear that they're grinding and of course because they're made out of plastic they're going to wear down pretty quickly. Here I have a USB watt meter. It's got its own built-in battery so it will not draw power from this. Let's plug this into the dynamo and then plug the CDR King light into our watt meter. And I'll try and zoom in on this so you can see how much power is generated while I'm cranking. So you saw the most we were able to generate is around 500 milliwatt or around half a watt whereas this states that you're going to be able to generate 500 milliamp 6 volts 500 milliamp is actually around 3 watts so instead of getting 3 watts we're getting just under half a watt so yeah i don't know who came up with the packaging for this but i don't think they had any idea what they're writing about because none of this actually matches up and I'm not sure what you could actually use this for because aside from lighting these little LED bulbs, which is completely impractical, there's not much else you can do with this. For example, if you try and charge this basic cell phone, it won't work. You can see it tries, but basically it just doesn't generate enough power. As a comparison, I've got this one from Shell. Let's plug the phone in. And there you go, the screen's come on and it's charging the cell phone. So this one can actually charge the cell phone, but the one from CDR King can't really do anything except for light this little LED bulb. And even that doesn't light very brightly. So it's kind of pointless. Um, I can't imagine any good reason to buy this. It's only 99 peso, so it is cheap, but I don't know what you could use this for, it's pretty much useless. When I try and charge a power bank with this, the power bank just stops trying to draw power because it's using more power running its circuitry than what it's actually being charged at. So yeah, I don't really know what the point of this is. So if you do see this in CDR King stores, don't bother buying it because it's pretty much useless. So if you enjoyed this video, please give a thumbs up and subscribe. Thanks for watching.